What's good, y'all? Welcome back to the one and only Pinnacle Gaming. I'm back at it with another video today. So apparently, guys, we have some big, big news. This is coming from a GameSpot article, which I'll leave down below in the description, pretty much talking about new developments in Santa Monica Studios. Let's get into it. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, apparently it's just been announced that the former SIE of Santa Monica Studios, Shannon Studstill, just left the company to head up a new Google Stadia studio. So I can imagine Google Stadia is probably pretty happy about that. Sony PlayStation announced that her placement would be Yumi Yang. Now, guys, uh, Yumi Yang, I just want to emphasize, Yumi Yang isn't no, you know, young buck in the game. Yumi Yang has been around for a long time. First, she started off as the senior producer, pretty much jumping all the way up to a director of product development before now taking over as the studio head. Now, yeah, guys, not only is she a 19 year veteran at Sony, she's also worked with Santa Monica for nearly 20 years. Even before that, she actually had a brief stint at EA as being the pretty much the development director, even going back before her time working on 2018's God of War. Yes, guys, you heard correctly. She's worked on the latest God of War of 2018 that we love and know. And um, pretty much they were saying that she was a big part of the And what she was pretty much doing at her time at Santa Monica was her role was the VP of product development. And she pretty much just helped the smaller independent teams incubate within the studios, which led to groundbreaking works like Journey and Underfinished Swan, if you guys have heard of those games. Multiple times through this article, Sony has, you know, pretty much just said how grateful they were for all the good work that she's done and whatnot. Not only that, but uh, they went so far as to say that she pretty much has unquestioned respect and trust of her peers at Sony and you know, at Sony Santa Monica and pretty much with her vast experience as you guys can see 19 years is quite a lot of time and her deep understanding of the studio you know she's pretty much the perfect person to be positioned to lead Santa Monica Studios. Now, guys, in my opinion, I think this is great that they have the right person to fit the right position, you know what I mean? Because at the end of the day, it's like, you know, you get the right person for the right job and we're in business. You feel what I'm saying? Like, looking at the situation, I feel like this is the best it really could have went because you have a pretty much a Sony slash Santa Monica veteran here actually filling in the position as the studio head. Not just some random person. It's somebody that knows Santa Monica inside and out. And that's also worked not not only in Santa, not only with Sony, but it's actually worked at EA. It's actually worked here and there. Like this is a person that has a lot of skills, and um, I mean it shows. Like look at the article. The article tells you pretty much all the information you need to know. You know she's very well respected by all the people at Sony. Um, she's very respected by all the p people at Santa Monica, and she's also very ap appreciated at Santa Monica. And at the end of the day, they went they went so far as to say that she's even you know part of the reason why God of War was so great. So uh, that being said, guys, yeah, I think this is an amazing thing. And um, at the end of the day, you know, I put my hats off to uh, Shannon Studstill. You know, she did a great job so far at Santa Monica with all the years. Uh, thank you for your service and whatnot. But, but you know what they say, out with the old and in with the new. And also, this type of thing happens, guys, you know. You know, studio heads are going to switch around here and there. But I feel like the most important point of that, the most important thing is that if you are gonna switch studio heads here and there willy-nilly you got to make sure that the, they're the right person for that position and there is nothing proving the contrary that she is not not only deserving but perfect for this leadership role because i'm looking at it and honestly she looks like she's exactly where she needs to be all right guys well that's the breaking news for today uh make sure you guys hit that like button and make sure you don't forget to hit that little bell icon make sure notifications are on so every time i come up with a video you can you can be the first one to see it i want to thank you guys for coming in and for watching me y'all have a good day and i'll see you later peace